Yeah. All, All right. right, and it looks like we're underway for round number two here. I mean, again, <laughs> with the precedent set by round number one, I mean, it's going to be tough to beat that, but here we go. That's right, so we've got Eric ICX, Fractal, Alex T, and Sharky. Amazing players. And you can see already right now, it looks like Fractal and Eric ICX are going with the start at level 19, 19 strategy. Mm -hmm. With a higher drop speed, you can get in possibly some more maxes. Or if you have a top out, just the added time that you get might get you a quantity of maxes you might not normally have. Oh, well, Eric is going to get a dirty. Yeah, right there. Oh, no, that, I think he got into, the Tetris into, into on Tetris. that one. Yeah, it was a yeah. triple into a Tetris. But man, I mean, we're at this point right now, you know, we were just saying this and one max out might not be enough to qualify anymore. <laughs> I think we're, yeah, we're well past that point. Um, I'll take a look at the, the chart and it's already pretty deep with maxes. Very few players have less than two. Obviously, if you guys are just tuning in right now on the stream at home, the amount of changes that have happened over during the pandemic while we've been playing this online has been unprecedented. And this game is almost at a point where if the last time you watched was the last live event at, here at the Portland Retro yeah. Gaming Expo, it might not even be a recognizable game anymore. Yeah, so much has changed. So much is evol evolving, even real time. You just have one big event and something can completely change the landscape. We saw it once with uh, Joseph having the torch passed from Jonas Neubauer in 2018. And then in 2019, Joseph continuing that. And then 2020, it going to a new generation, continuing the new generation with Dog. And now rolling has taken the center stage as a dominant play style. Yeah. And it's basically just opened it up now. Pretty much there is no limitations. And I mean, before, you know, with Daz and hyper tapping, it was about how fast can you get it over to the side? But at this point in time, there's just is no limitation anymore. Whatever you feel like, I swear, whatever it feels like you think you can do, you can. Yeah, we no longer call it the kill screen. Now we're saying things like 29 play. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> kill screen is but a recommendation now. <laughs> Kill screen is but a memory. And uh, perhaps it will be sorely missed. We will see how things shape up this year. You know, whether there needs to be adjustments made to our rule set. We, um, that's uh, one thing that we're going to be determining this year going yeah. forward. This is going to be a very pivotal year, not just for in terms of, you know, these players here and some of these players the first time to play at an off, you know, at the, oh, at the main absolutely. event live. A lot of these players were playing heavily in the online scene and uh, may or may not have been to you know, a large gaming event like this and that might either affect their performance or maybe they'll shine through. Yeah, I mean, obviously we've seen it ha obviously ha didn't affect Dog or Andy or Huff very much at all. But again, after this year, what's going to happen? A lot of a lot of considerations are going to have to be made. But again, that's one of the great things to see the game evolve. Like if we ever thought that, you know, it would continue to evolve and just grow and yeah, just and get to this point. It's so exciting. And the community helping to shape that evolution is amazing. Exactly. And also just having the complete faith in the CTWC leadership to establish great rules that we could play by and making sure that there's enough room, room and flexibility for, for us to be able to grow and evolve as the game progresses and players increase the ceiling of what's possible. <laughs> At this point in time, I feel like sky's the limit. Everything that we thought was, every time we feel like we've reached the next peak, we keep breaking it and it's, it's, it's absolutely wild. So in this set, Eric ICX currently with the lead at 653k. Fractal not far behind at 590. Alex T at 500 and Sharky at 432k. So all players, of course, the level 19 start players being much further along. So definitely a valid strat to start on 19 to get the faster drop speed and shorter games. 
Yeah, and it's almost interesting to say, because if I'm not mistaken, Sharky is still playing with the Daz method. And, you know, Sharky, obviously, one of the newer players. But at this point, it's kind of frightening to say that, you know, like, that's definitely Ooh, old school style that Sharky is using. Sharky needing some good pieces here. Dig out of this. Well, looks... Ooh, that okay. right side. Yeah, that. He's a couple of long bars. Kind of dependent right now. Really holding up for that long bar. Gets it. And triples. But that right side might be a problem. Gonna yeah. have to get a couple of things over to the right. Nice, Ooh, nice. survival. Wow. And look Amazing. at that. Amazing. Got it over there. And he's okay, still surviving. Okay, that right surviving. side. He needs to burn down. Definitely getting that thing over to the right. Oh, there's a long bar. It does not, it's not able to get anything over to the right. So Sharky will top out with that, and that will be a kicker for Sharky, 464K. Yep. Meanwhile, you see over here, obviously, Eric ICX, now the current record holder for highest score, and uh, Fractal and Alex T. Fractal, of course, been doing so great for the past few years as well. Eric ICX about to max. Two more will do it. There's one. 975K at level 26. And boom, Tetris for Eric. First max in the bag. <laughs> too easy. First of the set. <laughs> Fractal not too far behind. Three ought to do it. Yeah, he he's just needs a couple more Tetrises and then just some safe play, and he should be fine. He's set up for another and one. Boom, boom, Tetris for Fractal. So there you go. One and more. Yeah, and he's not even at level 29 yet, so he's got plenty yep. of time. He's going for center the center well. well right there. Well, now would not be the time for a draw. And there it boom. is, boom, max out. Max out for Fractal, center well. Another one in the back. And now you can see the extreme difference in speed that level 19 provides because mm. Alex T, still on first game, is only at level 24, 762K. So there's like a maybe 200,000, 300,000 point difference if you start on 19 and max versus a level 18 start. Boom, Tetris for Alex. Yeah, but you can see 67% rate right now. Alex is definitely still on track to get that max out. Little bit of a difficult situation for Eric right now. See if he can get himself out of this situation here. He's gonna have to go for some burns. And there we go. Where's that eyepiece? 33, P 33 line drought right now. There it is, okay. but it's just a triple. And of course, they're continuing to go with 19 start. We saw Huff employ this strategy in the last round. Yeah, I'm just watching right now on Eric's board right there. He's got himself actually set up a very dirty Tetris, but he takes the double instead. And now he's going to at least get that right well open up. So now he can just sit here and build on okay, some Alex row three. On the verge of maxing, just a few lines away. Takes a single here, single there, and another single. That will do it for Alex. First max on the board. Yeah, and Eric right now is choosing to go with these row three Tetrises right now. But again, the pieces are not being kind to him. He needs, yeah, look at this. He is in trouble here. Can he get himself out of this situation? My, can he get another long piece? He needs another Ooh, long piece. He's super dirty. Waiting for that one. There it is. Boom. <laughs> super dirty Tetris for Eric. And set himself up for that row three Tetris again. And boom. Tetris for Eric. And chooses not to clean. He's actually going to keep <laughs> going with this row three Tetris. The dirty master Eric. <laughs> the third dirty Tetris in a row. Woo. Keeps it going. And yeah, makes it out of that situation. So continuing on pace here. I mean, as you can see, Tetris rate of just 35% having to do a lot of that cleaning here. But again, because these players can play so long and, you know, Eric has a little experience playing for quite yep. some time. <laughs> so, you know, I don't think he's worried here. He knows he can still max out. Right, and since they're starting on level 19 and we're going for maxes, you basically don't want to waste any time if you can, but you also don't want to throw out a game. Yes. So. Just keep it going, and uh, if you hit level 29, just if you're Eric ICX, you're just gonna keep scoring and eventually hit it if you survive. Well, Fractal's got himself set up for a Tetris. Boom, Tetris for Fractal, 43%. But as you can see over there on Alex's side over there, starting off really strong here. 
Yep, Alex getting that first game underway. Sharky with the second game. No maxes yet, but looking to get that first one. Again, Eric in the same game setting himself up for these row three Tetrises and boom, Tetris for Eric. Eric very comfortable. Boom, Tetris for Eric. Another no, another row three, just content to stay there. Yeah, and he's going for it again. Yep. He's just going to keep working over here again. You know, with Boom, the, Tetris or Eric. Obviously, with the rolling, it's just, uh, you know, row three Tetris is at level 19 is not a, <laughs> a scary thing. Very doable. I will say this, though. If you're doing your drops on row three, the drop time is reduced even less. That's true. <laughs> so you're saving maybe a fraction of a second for every drop. That does add up. That's like a Tetris Grandmaster trick right Yeah, there. that is super <laughs> deep strats, just completely maximizing every drop time, having it higher up to the top. And it's working out for him so far. Absolutely. Wow. I don't know how many back-to-backs that were. That's at least five probably. Because if you remember right now, uh, Fractal and Eric kind of maxed out near the same time before. And as you can see right now, Eric is at line 150 and Fractal's at yep. line 130. So you can see that that, yeah, little extra speed has been making a little bit of difference playing on that row three. Who would have thought? Just... Adding to the aggressive play style <laughs> that Eric is known for. Is that the next level? Intentionally playing on higher rows? For max outs? Absolutely. For uh, versus? Right, yeah. Um, it's not so much of a race, so, but in this, you actually want to get as many maxes as possible. But we'll see. If you become really comfortable doing it, I mean, why not? Boom, Tetris for Eric. Not at row three, but in column three that time. Hey, Sharky hitting transition, 600k, good game here going for Sharky. Yeah, excellent Tetris raid right now at 73%, but as you can see, running into a little bit of a drought, it's gonna have to do a little clean perfect. Is he gonna take the triple? He yep. does. Yes. Alex T still chipping away at game two, 400k, looking to get a pretty good transition here. Again, not to belabor the point, but obviously Sharky, one of the last remaining Daz players that we have in the tournament. Bags down another Tetris. Great to see Daz still a force to be reckoned with here. Players like Sharky making a statement nice. for that. Nice little micro adjustment by Fractal there but he needs that uh, J piece and they are not giving him the J. Oh, finally got it, but had to burn the I piece over there on the side and boom, Tetris for Fractal. Yeah, Eric and Fractal very close in score right now. Again, Eric had to do a lot of cleaning. Yeah, there was a lot of burning on Eric's side. So despite the faster drop speed of playing on row oh, three, okay. Which I, we're not calling Fractal's been playing a beast of okay, a game okay. here. Yeah, he's going to have to have a lot of level 29 play in order to get that max out. I mean, he's actually not doing too bad. He's already gotten his percentage all the way back up to 43%. It was down at 30 some percent originally, but here we go. Level 29 play. Is he going to get the line piece? There it is. Boom, Tetris for Eric. And he's opened up the well over there on the right side. He needs to do Ooh. some more cleaning here. Here we are with level 30, that 29 play, no longer kill screen, but 29 play. Now Oof. all the factor in this outcome. Eric looking for that second max, split triple. Yeah. 903,000. And he's at a point right now where he can set himself up yep. for another Tetris, except the pieces are not coming down properly for him. Actually now, looks like things are clean, here we go. Oh, the cool. eyepieces are coming a little too early. Here Alex we go. Where's the eyepiece? Nope. Going to go for the clean instead. Yep, he's just playing it safe right now. Not being overly aggressive, but he needs that eyepiece on the left. Mm. Triple. Still 50,000 away. 50,000 plus two away. Tetrises. 
and we'll see if the strategy is to continue lining or if it'd be faster just to get a risky Tetris. I mean, at this point in time, I think he might be better off playing safe right yeah. now because he's kind of in that groove. I think that's just where his mentality is right now. And yeah, look at this! Guarantee the max. Fractal also level 31 looking for that second max. So both players on the verge of getting their second maxes here with that post-29 play. And a triple? triple! Look at that! He just Aaron needs another 7,000 points! Yep. 8,000 points! Lines really wants to get it. Okay. Double! Double. There, there it is! is. At the exact Eric's second. Simul and Fractal. Max out! Simul Max out. <laughs> Eric Simul. and Fractal. The 19 starters. <laughs> both banging down their second max. Like, Let's go. Literally, like, I swear that was like less than a second apart right there. Both of them maxing out at the exact same time. Yeah, that's how highly competitive this is. It's really great that they're they're kind of like playing side by side just to uh, maybe even have like a way to pace themselves so <laughs> they know how to hard to push. I just look at how he's doing. Oh. Hey, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it right from Eric himself. Yeah. That's, he just looks how, he, how Fractal's doing and uh, can throttle their aggression accordingly. And Fractal with an interesting start. He, I think he kind of accidentally started on the right side a little bit, and so now he's transitioned himself back over. He's all set up and ready to go. That's it. 713 now. Tag used to say Alex T, now it says Thatchy, so I guess we'll call him Thatchy. And um, in okay shape. There might have to be some post-29 play on that, but set up for a couple of Tetris. It has to cover the... Yeah, there the we go. Well. It's open. Now he just needs a line piece. But look at that. 30-piece oh. drought right now. Finally shows up, of course, after he's already plugged up the hole. That's the way the... Ooh, dangerously high. Can... Uh, good okay. survival. Still needs some good pieces. No. And no, isn't able to. So that's yeah. going to be a kicker. 725. That was unfortunate. That was definitely like a 30-some line piece drought, and it yeah. just really put him in such an unrecoverable position. Not only that, but the pieces that he was getting were not allowing him for quick, easy burns as well. Very tough situation to handle there. But again, in this qualifying round, you can't rest. As soon as that happens, you start the next game and go. Yeah, same thing happened to Sharky over there. So Sharky's still looking for that first max. Thatchy looked for a second, and uh, Eric and Fractal both at two apiece. Continue with the level 19 starts. Definitely seeing that as being a valid strat here in the qualifiers. Well, again, they both have two max outs already, so definitely working out for them. And a dirty, no, that's not even a dirty Tetris. Oh, that was a beautiful clean there. And he's going to be able to get a Tetris there in column four. And now Fractal is continuing to try to clean. And there we go, he just... Oh, Alex. Early top out, but... Gonna get right back in there. Yeah, obviously one of the most unique aspects of uh, Thatchy's play over there is the is the posture, the, the stance that he's got over there playing. It's definitely not an easy feat to play that way. <laughs> it's just feet. All right. Sharky. Starting off a new game here. You can see right now 91% Tetris rate. See if you can keep this up for a long period of time. It's one of the hardest mm -hmm. things is that, you know, it can start off really well, but you're going to hit a dry spell <laughs> at some point in time. That's the way it works. And how you survive those is key. So Eric pulling ahead a bit. 370k. Fractal not too far behind, but has some cleaning to do. Yeah, very awkward. Wow, is he really going for that column? No, yeah, it is a Tetris. He's got yep. himself set up for oh. a Tetris, but he's not getting the pieces. And yeah, that's going to be an awkward burn sequence here. Needs just the right. Oh, but he needed oh, that the right TP. Side's impossible. He needed the TP. So he needed fractal. The TP's. Yeah, yeah. Finally gets a top out, and we'll have to restart to get the third max. Yeah, it's got a 303 kicker. <laughs> So, kicker for Fractal, 303k. Eric's still perfect. Yep. Again, we already had... I mean, if it wasn't for that last game, Dog had 13 in a row. Yeah. And he could have had 14 with... It, 14 max outs in a row. Wasn't meant to be, so him and his brother Andy will... Are the, the top two right yeah, now, right? With finished a, with 13. A 13 in a row each. 
So Eric, having that record to try to achieve, is in great position with these 19 starts and not having topped out yet. You know, it's so funny because every year we do this, we talk, we always make comments about how amazing it is, the kind of scores you need to qualify. I feel like we're even beyond that right now, just with how these players are playing, like talking about the scores that you need is not, doesn't even do it justice on how crazy you have to be in this game nowadays. So Eric having trouble getting that column three opened up there. He's got it open right now. He needs that long bar and it will not come at the right time. Now he needs a T or a Z. Finally gets one of them. There's that T. All right, so he's still trying to dig through over there. He is having so much trouble getting into that column three. That is where the big problem lies here. Oh, oh no, he missed More it. holes developing. Okay, that's gonna help a lot. Yeah, eyes on Eric right now to see if he can make a survival run over and here. And that, boom, Tetris for Eric. Or is Actually, that just a triple. triple. Oh, I thought yeah. that was Tetris. It looked like it, just shy. So he should be clean now, so he should be able to survive, so. Uh, but again, you can see that Tetris rate down to 55%. My, if he can play cleanly from here, he could still potentially not need the level uh, 29 play. But he's running out of time there, so he's probably going to need that level 29 play to be able to get the max out. Meanwhile, as you can see, Thatchy over there getting that Tetris. Boom. Sharky's game looking good now. 500k plus transition and on the way. Yep, just need four more lines. If he gets another Tetris, that will be the transition. Nice micro adjustment right there from Sharky. Nice. Boom, and there it is, the transition. 519. Sharky looking for that first max. Good yeah. position to do so. 64% Tetris rate as well. He's looking in a good place right now. And Thatchy just hitting 100 lines now. Looking for that second max. I love Fractal's expressions when he's playing, but I mean, <laughs> those expressions don't might mean that the pieces aren't coming friendly, but there it is, clean boom, and still at an 81%. Hey, Eric looking good at level 27, only needs a couple more Tetrises. Yeah. And 961. I was saying he's still at that point where he could still make it without needing any level 29 play. There we go. Finally, the Tetris a couple is set of long up. Bars. There's one. There's one. Boom. And, and he, actually, at this point just in time, a couple lines could do it. Singles at this point. Yeah, yeah you can see more. he's just going for is. the easy. Nicely Max done. Number three for Eric. Nicely done for Eric. So that's nine. That's uh, three in a row now. Yep. Well, three actually not in a row, but three for Eric here. I, I that that would be in a row. It is in a row. Yeah. You're right. You're right. He's still perfect. No right. no top outs. Wow, Fractal right here. Might be heading into a drought over here. Gonna be doing a little cleaning. You can see right there. Playing high, that's what you need to do. Yeah. Ooh, kind of dependent. Okay, opens up the well. Tough situation here. How is he gonna clean through this? Eyepiece came at the wrong time. Oh, he's still okay. Where's that long bar again? There it is, finally, and boom. Tetris from Fractal with the knowing Tetris nod right there. That's your level 21 now. 566 after transition, looking for a dirty Tetris, but has to burn it down. And, and gets the dirty Tetris. Eric struggling through here a little bit. Needs to clean out. You can see a lot of gaps in his field right now, but should be able to take care of most of them. Yeah, doesn't want to stick that on the side. You want the T piece over there on the right side. Oh, and he's going for that row two Tetris. Yep, row two. Trying he's... to get that faster drop speed, I guess. Yeah, we saw him playing uh, on that row three earlier, mm -hmm. but 
just kind of ended up playing out this way, and I think he's just going to keep going with it. He's going to need two tucks, and there it is, back to back. And now set up for that Tetris again. Yep. Boom, Tetris Boom, for Tetris Eric. Eric. Yep, just, uh, just working that row two there. Very comfortable. Let's see if he transfers the well or not. Actually goes left well. Oh, and he's going to keep going over there, and it's going to pay off. Boom, there you go. Now, if he gets that, no, he's going to keep going. No, okay, okay. Okay, well transfer, so back down to the bottom. Fractal at 914, so yeah, look to get that third max out. There we go. Finally has that well open over there again, and there it is. Boom, Tetris for Fractal. Trying to clean up a little bit. You see that? A couple more. There's one. Boom, Tetris for Fractal. One Tetris away. For maximum number three. And there Boom, it is. There Boom, there it is. Tetris for Fractal. Nicely Eric done. Eric and Fractal now at three apiece. Fractal having one top out, so Eric with slight time advantage here. Well into this fourth game. Sharky's going for a dirty Tetris. Oh, where's that long bar, though? There, there it, it is. is. Boom, Tetris for Sharky. Dirty center well. Love to see it. Nicely done. Oh, there you go. There's the split burn right there. Nice. I actually really like that play there from Sharky. And unfortunately, does not have a Tetris set up for himself. Actually, it is a Tetris. Never mind. Beautifully done. And it looks like he's going to keep trying to play at that. He's going for a row four Tetris, dirty Tetris here on Daz. It is level 18. Okay, Thatchy now 29. Okay, you can see some post 29 play out of Thatchy here. Looking for that second max. 894k. Definitely holding up here. Want to get that long bar in there. Has to cover the well. Okay, it's open again. Definitely the rolling coming into play here. Make that second max possible here in post 29 play. The poles in the stack appearing. Nice solve there. Opens up the well, covers it up. Just can't get the long bar at the right time to be able to capitalize on the Tetris and to get the points needed for the second max. That she's holding up. Getting the dig done. Okay. Okay. 939k, 940k. Sets up the center well. Waiting for the long bar. Okay. Opens up the well again. Man, that long bar is just not cooperating. There it is. Boom. Tetris for Thatchy. 983. Yeah, now he's got to clean. Can he survive this? Look at this. Gets that long bar over to the left. Oh, there it triple. is. Triple. Oh, just a couple line clears. There it is. Woo. Alex with a second backs out. And you can see on the board now. How happy he is about that one. Yeah, clutching that one out. So important. Nicely done. Amazing survival skills and rolling speed for Thatchy. GG's. Well, over here, Sharky is keeps ending up being uh, piece dependent to finish out these uh, gaps over here. You can see right now he needs a long bar, but instead, oh, okay, he's gonna go for a single over there, clean out, and now he should be nice, clean, and safe if he can just get that. Oh no, is he going for the dirty Tetris? He is. Sharky's going for the dirty Tetris in column number four. And there it is, boom! Tetris for Sharky, and he's gonna maintain it right now. Boom, nice. Tetris for Sharky, and what a clean transition to a nice board as well. Meanwhile, Eric ICX are current leaders, looking for that fourth max, 786K. Really good transition score, could get a really early max here if this pace continues. Uh oh, a little bit of a, a, a flub right there. If he can get an eyepiece, though, he should get himself comfortably. Oh, well, oh covered it up, well it's going to work out fine. He's, the eyepiece is still going to be very useful to him right now. Going to have to do a little bit of burning over here. Where's that? Needs another one. 13-piece trout. Going to do the cleaning, and there it is. Boom. And he just needs that TP's perfect timing. Nice. Gets the back-to-back -back Tetrises. Of course, obviously, back-to-back -back Tetrises don't give you any extra points here on NES Tetris. 
but they sure do help get you that max faster. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and right, just like that, Eric ICX, 956k, two Tetrises away from maxing here at level 26. 69% Tetris raid. Yeah, he's looking really strong right now. Fractal running into a little bit of a drought. 21-piece drought. There it is, finally. Boom. Eric ICX. And Eric, Another yeah. max, number four. Dropping the controller Flawless. down in absolute confidence there. I love it. Feeling confident, feeling good about himself. Jumping right back yep. into game number Eric five. With, with authority, looking to gun down that... 13 record max by Dog and Andy. <laughs> With all these 19 starts, it's definitely doable. Fractal, of course, working on his. Is it going to be? Fractal's still at three, so. Three. Okay. Eric and Fractal are virtually tied in the potential maxes they can get. It's just that Fractal had a top out, Eric didn't, so right. they're about half a game apart. Thatchy looking for max number three now, Sharky looking for the first. Switching poses right here, switching stances. And boom, Tetris for Eric. Good start for him in this game, as you can see, 88%, but it's still early, only 32 mm -hmm. lines in. Again, just as a reminder to everybody watching at home right now, we do have a Matcharino going for this tournament here. You guys can donate to the prize pool. The prize pool already up above 3,000 last time I heard. Not sure what it's at right now, but again, if you guys are enjoying this, I mean, as I always ask, are you not entertained by these <laughs> players here? The amazing feat of Tetra skill is here. If you want to make sure that these guys get rewarded, for their play, you can definitely contribute to that match, Arino. Thank you guys so much to everybody who has already donated. Yeah, it's a great way just to be involved and uh, to, to help make you know, all these players' efforts worthwhile and to you know put on this great show that you're all enjoying today. And also a message, uh, if you're enjoying this Tetris action on Classic Tetris 1, or, well, just Classic Tetris, there's also more qualifying rounds being streamed on Classic Tetris 2. So go ahead and open up another tab, another browser, and uh, check out even more Tetris action in our qualifiers. All right, Fractal's just waiting for that long bar right now. Playing a little bit aggressive over here. Nope, is going to finally go for the cleaning. Now he's oh. got it freed open, but you can see right there, 23-piece drought. There and it is. Boom. boom. Tetris Fractal. There it is. Another max out. Now it's also at four. <laughs> that's always the worst when you need that one last Tetris, and that's when the drought kicks in. That's when it always feels like that, you know, the, the RNG is not in your favor at that time. But for those of you at home keeping track, that was my first mention of RNG. <laughs> so Thatchy getting close to transition here. Great transition score. Going to be over 600k if this bangs down to Tetris here. Yeah, but he's not getting that, uh, the S piece or the T piece. Yeah, just a facing position of the piece, not cooperative. Oh, nice, nice solve there. There you go, there Keeping you go. It clean. Transitioning at 599, so about as close as 600k as you can get for a transition. Oof, a little bit of a missed drop right there from Thatchy again. Not going to be, you know, it's not going to cause him any to top out or anything like that. But again, you're going to spend a little bit of time cleaning, and so you do lose a little bit of those Tetrises. But of course, you know, before in the past years, it was all about that Tetris rate. That was the most important thing. But these days, yeah, throw that's... it all out because post 29 <laughs> play is here. Yeah, the efficiency is not the determining factor anymore. The combination of efficiency and survival skills. Mm -hmm. Literally, the game has changed. And Sharky transitioning 524K. 
Got Good it. position to Max here. And there's yeah, the goes. Tetris right there. See both Eric and Fractal very much on pace with great Tetris rates and great boards. That is where the efficiency does help, is that obviously you can get a Tetris before you get to level 29. You don't want to have to oh, yeah. survive on level 29, and but it, you can. <laughs> and this is essentially a time attack, so the faster you get that max, the faster you can work yep. on the next one. Oh, so smart by Fractal. That's you looking really good right now, level 23 at 824k. Oh, Fractal. Yeah, there we go. Finally getting some of the pieces that he needs. But here's a very, where is that long bar? He's going to go for the clean over there. He needs to. Now he's looking for the J piece. There it is. It comes and gets him a triple. Two triples. Back-to-back -back triples. Dude, what is with these droughts that Fractal is 34. running into? Finally, and there's a long bar. Boom, Tetris for Fractal. And boom, another one for Fractal. 72%. Ooh, Thatchy with a missed drop on the left. Going to have to burn down some things to access that left side. Rolling will get it over, and it does. And Thatchy setting himself a, a requirement for that Elvis. A missed drop right roof. there. This is not a great situation here. There's the eyepiece. Okay. Oh, it's the wrong one. Yeah, Thatchy losing some pace here, so there's going to be closer to 29 as... Uh, 882k, 884k going into level 27 here. Yeah, but he needs so many long pieces. Yeah, he's just going to fill in there. Go for the triple Gotta over there. Burn it down, prepare for level 29. Oh, perfect. Finally, the T piece and the L piece in a row. Okay. So there Almost we go. Back down. Thatchy burning it back down. And, and boom! boom! Tetris for Thatchy, 939. So a couple of Tetrises away on level 28. So it could still clear before 29. In great position to do so. Yeah. That up now. But here comes that drought again. There Boom, it is. Tetris Thatchy, one Tetris away. And just waiting on that long bar for that third max. Boom, Tetris for Thatchy. Third max out. Looking for more. All right. So again, starting off round qualifiers number two with just so many max outs. As you can see right here, Sharky needs to clean out over here. Doesn't want to, there we go. And finally has column number, oh, he couldn't get it over there fast enough. Of okay, Eric, a couple of Tetris is away now from. Perfect. Max five. Okay, there it is. Another max for Eric. <laughs> I love the emphaticness of Eric's standing up every time he gets that max. Makes it easier for the judge to take the picture. <laughs> And oh, Eric's yeah. off to another game. And Sharky, not going to quite make it there. Going to top out at that point, reset the game. Going to reset again, it looks like. Going to start another game here. Here we go. So Sharky still looking for that first max out. Yeah, Eric, our current leader with five max outs. No top outs. Flawless so far. Wow. Fractal not far behind. Boom, Tetris for Fractal. Yeah, Fractal Ooh. also looking for that fifth. Fractal and Eric just oh. half a game away oh. from each other. Great pieces for Fractal right here. Gonna have to clean out a little bit. But where's that long bar? There it is. Okay. And another one. Boom. That rolling, getting that piece over there to the side fast enough. Not going to be enough for a Tetris right there. Didn't want to take the triple. How is he going to fill that out? There we go. He's got the T piece. Sets up the LJ requirement. And nice, perfectly. But, oh, oh this is rough. Okay. Oh, just nice. in time. And yeah, the fist okay, bump the right fist there. Bump. Yeah. yeah, boom. Fractal's feeling it. Wants that fifth max. Let's go. And there you go. Look at that. Three Tetrises in a row. Now Fractal in an extremely clean board. Eric with a lot of holes in that play field. Going to have to burn some. Yeah, and we've seen that a lot from Eric. But again, it hasn't affected him. He's still perfect on max outs. Yep. Flawless. 
I mean, no top outs. That's something to be said. I mean, if you're a player and you've been running into holes and these kind of bad pieces and you're still maxing out every single time, there's just no fear at this point. You know, you've got to just be playing with the utmost confidence. Looking for that talk and he missed it right there. Didn't quite get it. It's okay. He should be able to clean out there. <laughs> just needs. Okay, he's going to do it with the eyepiece. A fractal on the verge of maxing here. Kind of playing up high. Not completely deadly yet, but could use some better pieces to Ugh. clear it back down. Yeah, I can get a piece over there onto the left. Ooh, there it is. That's that triple. And yeah. could, oh, man. depending on how the dig goes, could just get the points from the dig. Yep, there's the clean, the clean. He's set up uh, for another set up for Tetris. Tetris. Probably going to do it if the is. long bar comes. Or he could just take the, the triple. triple. No, and, not uh, quite another. enough, but the double's going to do it. Right Fractal. there. Max number five for Fractal on the board. Something smart play right there, just knowing that he didn't need to wait for that long piece. was yeah, right take there. The triple. Triple's take good enough. It. And Sharky's going to reset. So yeah, I mean, honestly, outside of the one single top out from uh, Fractal, him and Eric are kind of going uh, back to back, but a few unfortunate pieces right here for Eric. Yeah, Eric in a high dig now. Oh. See those survival skills. Where's that long bar? No, not gonna wait for it, actually. Gonna give up that chase. Good solve there, opens it up. There it is, okay. okay. That's gonna double. Blood. Gets him a little bit cleaner out of that situation. And there we go. Perfect. Has himself into a situation. Boom, Tetris for Eric. Beautiful dig out of that situation. And he's going to get back to backs right there. Establishing himself a beautiful neutral board. Yeah. Nice and clean now for Eric. Looking good to get that six max. Yeah, now it's Fractal's turn to do a little bit of digging over here. TP should be able to open that up, but now he needs another long bar. There it is, boom. Tetris for Fractal. Eric about to hit transition. He's playing up a bit high, but starts to burn it down and prep. You don't see too many transitions being Confident up that high, but Eric's comfortable. Let's see Fractal right here, got himself his board cleaned up again. Gets a Tetris. 57% Tetris rate for Fractal right now, but of course still early on, only line mm -hmm. 50. Still quite a ways from that transition. Eric, of course, just transitioned. Open up his board a little bit here. Now waiting for the long bar. There it is. Boom, Tetris for Eric. Working on uh, six in a row. Uh, yeah, this would be number six for both okay. Eric and Fractal. Should they max these games. Thatchy working on number four. Sharky working on the first. Still needs to get one on the board. Looking good here, though, at halfway to transition, 285k. Tetris for Eric, and Eric with a clean, clean field now. Yeah, level 23, 711 can uh, get a good early max here. Good pace. Well, 56% Tetris rate, but definitely get that max. Eric not quite getting the pieces that he wants, so he's doing a little yeah, bit of burning is. here, but has himself set up for the Tetris, and boom, Tetris for Eric. Fractal with the jury set up, waiting for that long bar. Keeps column three alive. <laughs> Keeps or cleaning row, row it. Row three, the row three Tetris, boom, dirty for Fractal. Fractal impressed with himself there. And well, now he's just, I just love that the well transition turning the dirty into a non-dirty center well. Boom, Tetris for Fractal with a fist bump. Yeah, and there we go. Transition beautifully back to that neutral screen. 
neutral state. And uh, Eric zeroing in on a max here. Level 27, 917k. Looking for three more Tetrises to close the deal. There's one. And now set up for the next one. And there it comes, boom. Just needs one more or just to go for the triples or, or just singles. Looking to fill in, it gets a triple. It's not gonna do it, but the next line will. Nicely done, there we go. That yeah, is number six. six in a row for Eric ICX. So flawless. Woo. Eric going for that record here. The record being 13 established by Dog. Dog and Andy both having 13, but Dog having a kicker and Andy without one. So Dog is still the overall record leader for number of max outs here in our qualifiers. I think next year we're going to have to start counting non-max outs. That's how <laughs> we determine. <laughs> you get one kicker now. Um, so Thatchy zeroing in on this next max. There Dance it is. It down. All right. That's got to be number four for Thatchy. Mm, and accidentally an early slide right there from Sharky. He was trying to get that piece. Oh, but actually, is he going to? Oh, no, it's just going to be a triple. He's got to take that. Yeah, Sharky wanting to get in, get that Tetris taken care of for transition here. Boom, Tetris for Sharky into transition. 537K, still looking for that first max. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Hangs the long bar. And uh, just does reset to get back into it as fast yeah. as possible. That missed drop right there yes. on that S so P sudden. Z piece just blocked the I piece from being able to make it all the way over there. Eric with a very... Eric way up high. Yeah. Needs that long bar. There it is. Ooh. And it's still burning through there. Not out of it yet. Yeah, I mean, obviously, he could just maybe give up the ghost and start a new game. But at this point in time, I feel like everybody wants to try to get as many in a row as they can. Yeah, you want to be time efficient. I mean, it just started, but yeah, Eric's going to keep going with this. And right. uh, I mean, it's a good feeling when you've got flawless play, right? No top outs. Like. <laughs> Tetris, Tetris trick, yeah. for Eric, Eric's and now just there out of it, Just like that, the, you know, the amazing survival skills, just keeping it alive there. You know, why not just keep going for it, right? Like, top oh. outs take time. Oh, <laughs> well, Z fine. bursted. See a nice column of Zs just stacked up in the middle. And another one adding to the pile. Right, and there you see right there, Eric nicely filling out those columns uh, eight and nine. Got himself another Tetris. Bechtel on row two, looking to score. Needs about a little bit more than two Tetrises. Well, well Max oh Fractal really needs a lot more. Gets it. Boom, Tetris for Fractal. Finally, and he's Keeps so dirty close. Open. Boom. Boom, Tetris for Not Fractal. Not quite there. Couple of line clears. Again, yeah, it doesn't need to go for anything crazy but over here. The, the triple, triple and that will do, do it. it. Fractal with number six. Tied at 6-6 six, six for Eric versus Fractal. Both of them gunning for the dog Andy record of 13. And the craziest thing was that dog was on the verge of getting 14, 14 yeah. in a row if it wasn't for that one drought of 35 pieces. 35 drought, eyepiece drought. I'm going to look up what the kicker is for dog on that game. It was 877, so 13 and 877 is the current <laughs> qualifier record. <laughs> So even if you get 13, you're going to need a pretty big kicker to be in the lead for our seeding. Both Eric and Fractal working on their game number sevens here in terms of max out, but ooh, a little bit of a missed drop right there from Eric. Rotated that piece, I feel like, a little too early. So he's going to have to do a little bit of digging. And again, this is the power of rolling. You can still dig even this high up. You see he's got himself out of that situation right now, just waiting for the ability to clean. Yep, there it is, but still blocked. Opened up again. 20-piece drought, however. Still waiting for that long bar. Oh, thank you, Eric. The battery died. Dead battery. Might be a dead battery on the mic. Yeah, dead battery. I think so, yeah. 
All right, boom Tetris for Eric now. See over there, Thatch, he needs to clean up his board just a little bit. Oh no, had a last second mind change right there and it might have cost him a little bit, but he should be okay. There we go, oh no, didn't open it up in time. Still needs another long piece. There it is, boom, Tetris with Thatchy. Meanwhile, Eric working on a dirty Tetris. Yep, there it is, and he's got it set up, and boom, Tetris for Eric. Thatchy hanging the long bar up on the left. Burns it down, gets it safe again. Should be able to fill it up right there, yep. yep. Again, Eric working on his seven max out in a row. There's that long bar, boom. Fractal. Nope, that was a triple, it's not gonna go for it. This one has an on-off switch, I'll take it. And there it is, boom. Tetris for Fractal, but as you can see right now, 41% Tetris rate there, so needs to get that percentage up a little bit so that he can, uh, doesn't have to have as much level 29 play. It's up to 46% now. Now 15 piece drought here, but there it is, boom, Tetris for Fractal. Gonna continue setting that up, nice, he's got himself set up for another Tetris here. Have to do a little bit of cleaning. Go on, Tetris for that, G. 18 piece drought. Fractal with a couple back to back droughts over here, but still manages to pull that off and actually gets to That's just boom, the perfect pieces. Fractal. Another Tetris for Fractal. Fractal coming out of that dig. Just raining Tetrises, but you want to see. Yeah, it's not easy to get out of a dig and raise your Tetris rate because he definitely was at 41% just earlier, now at 53%, so definitely still at max out pace before the uh, quote kill un unquote screen. <laughs> and Eric working on that max here is about two, two Tetris is away, maybe two and change, one more and change probably. Now he just needs an L or a J, there it is, finally an L for Fractal. All right, Eric, one Tetris away. Okay, there's the single for Eric. And, and boom! boom! Seven max. in Seven a row. Maxes. Wow, and, still flawless. And this is all on level 19 start, so he is going through this quickly. Yeah, all 19, all maxes. Were Dog and Andy, were they starting on 18? They were, they right? They were 18s, They yeah. were 18s, yeah. Dog and Andy yeah. were on 18 starts. Yeah. So if Eric keeps this up, he definitely has the potential to get well over 13 max outs. I don't remember our start time, but if you play it out right, you get about seven maxes an hour. So 14 is where you kind of want to be if you play perfectly. And of course, Fractal working on his seventh max out. As yeah, you can Fractal see. right behind Eric. And as you can see here too, I mean, remember I was mentioning his Tetris rate was, uh oh, a little bit of a missed drop right there. He's got to do a little bit of cleaning. There it is, gets yep, that clean. And, and there it goes, long bar's gonna help a lot. Fractal. He's still saving that, oh no, never mind. Okay, there he goes, burns through there. And just needs a two by, there it is, there it is. And now he's set up for that, but he does have a reliance on the L piece, but there is that L piece. Thatchy now. Then three Tetrises, a max number five, who hangs that long bar. Yeah, again, that hang over there would 
spell doom for uh, standard Daz players, but oh no, we couldn't get that piece coming. all the way to the other side. That you need to get that board back under control. Because even if you could play 29, you don't want it looking like that. Yeah, and here we go. Can he survive this? He's just going for the cleans yeah. right now. Yeah, Thatchy digging back down. That's the right call. Gets Ooh. it back into under control. Perfect. And look at this. He's almost got Drill a perfectly all the way neutral back down board. To the bottom. There it is. There it is. Ready oh, no. for Tetris. Needs a long bar now. Ah. Oh, gets a long bar. It's too late, but a good kicker. 951 for Thatchy. Still just. at four. Axe out. Ooh, just missed it right over there. And that's one of the hardest things at that speed. One mistake just cascades itself and just spreads into just the most unfortunate situation. Meanwhile, Eric here with a beautiful dig is almost out of there. He is out just waiting for the long bar now. There it is. Boom, Tetris for Eric. I think I might have missed what happened over our fractal screen over there. Uh, he's definitely trying to wait for the perfect tuck, and there's one piece that he's got there. And boom, Tetris for fractal. We are definitely starting a new game here. So it looks like fractal did not get a seventh uh, max out. Am I blowing the data. I don't see a kicker either, so okay. we're waiting for the data to catch up. But yeah, Eric working on on number eight now. Darky's still looking for the first. Good shape now, about 597k, level 20. Ooh. Trouble on Sharky's board. He's going to have to dig a little bit, but probably still save this one. Yeah, but he's going to have to do a lot of cleaning right now. I'm actually getting some good pieces for that. Unfortunately, he has to keep blocking that hole in column five over there. Nice last second adjustment by Sharky, but that piece doesn't have any place to go. He should be able to slide the T piece in there. Perfect. Nicely done. Oh, maybe slid that one a little bit too far. Sharky. Basically playing to survive at this point. Got the eyepiece. There we go. Perfect stops. And the eyepiece. Back yeah. Down. Oh, Sharky Sharky's just blocked that up. Was unfortunate time, but there we go. It. Boom. Tetris for Sharky. 685. Nice. Oh, he is saving that Tetris. He's got it open yep. again. He needs that long bar. He's going to go for the clean right there. Oh, where's the long bar? Where? So many little droughts like this. 20 pieces. Oh, man. Had Are you serious? Oh. And isn't able to do anything with that, but manages to clear a little bit of it away, but it's left kind of a mess and level 26. Probably, oh. uh, There's so much Darkie frustration right there. Right now. He played so well and had it all set up, but just that one line piece drought just took him down. And ah, uh, those droughts are so killers, man. Ugh. Yeah, we've seen players who are known for maxing not being able to get that first max on the board. And that's super important now because with the field the way it is now, so stacked, you're going to need multiple maxes to make gold bracket, if not silver at this point. Yeah, like we said earlier, you know, if you talk to us five years ago and said one max out might not be enough to qualify. <laughs> yeah. Actually, to give you an idea of that, she's doing really well, but on the leaderboard, I mean, what would you guess four maxes and a good <laughs> kicker would give you? It's 15th place oh. currently, which is insane. But 15th place is gold bracket, so 
Thatchy already in the running there. Oh, perfect timing to get that. Now he's going to have to dig through there. Not, interesting flat burn right there. This time, going to throw it in there. Oh, no, he didn't get the piece all the way over to the side. And again, that air is cascading itself. Oh. And he's trying to save up for a long bar. Didn't quite get it. Okay, he's going to have to do some burns. Can he survive this? But again, uh, uh, an eyepiece drought. Got to figure out how to clean this board right now. Oh, nice. Got that piece all the way over to the Thatchy left. really got this dig going. Oh, no. Okay. Perfect. He's a long bar. Okay. He's still alive. There's the long bar, Ooh. but oh, oh no. He just up. blocked it. Board's still manageable. A nice, oh, it really dirty catch from, from Thatchy. <laughs> and and it's almost out of trouble here. Yeah, that'll <laughs> keep him wow. alive. Look at these burns. <laughs> Thatchy just a showcase of survival skills here. Wow. Look at that. Can't get any more by the skinnier teeth than that. <laughs> And Eric about to max again here. This needs a couple more light clears. There's a single, and there's a double. There That's enough. It. There it is. And Eric now with eight, eight in a row. And that definitely puts him in the same uh, spot as Hydrant and Allen. One under try stop. Except we've still got time on the clock. <laughs> of course, in first and second, our dog and Pixel Andy, and of course, Huff with one max out behind. Ooh, Thatchy going for a dirty, no. Oh, actually perfect wow. timing, there it is. And look at that clean as well. Gonna get that burn and yeah, is he gonna go for a dirty Tetris here? No, he's gonna go for the clean. He's gonna try to stay alive right here. Get Thatchy's himself set up. Or just going from complete chaos to perfect order <laughs> in moments. Wow. And go boom. Tetris with Thatchy. Six sixty-five k at level twenty-six. You know, not the great pace, but Thatchy has that post twenty-nine play that we're probably going to see a lot of here. Yeah, at forty-three percent, he's going to definitely need some level twenty-nine play. Eric, right now, trying to clear out that board. He's got himself that Tetris ready again, but he has a little bit of a reliance on the JP's. Nice, perfect. Set himself up for the L, but he's going to get the L piece in time. And boom, Tetris for Eric. Again, still early on in his game, so definitely can build up that Tetris rate. Fractal, of course. Yep, not early in the game. Working on that next max, 806K. Where's the J? Okay, now he needs the L. Oh, okay, actually nicely done. Okay. okay. Now, Boom, Tetris for Fractal. This is going to be uh, some major level 29 play. He's still over 100,000 away. So, yeah, this is going to be a significant time post 29 here to get that and eight max for Fractal. And sure enough, you can do this just by getting singles and triples and doubles all the way through. But remember, that's going to take up more time. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Tetris. And Alex, another one. Thatchy topping out there. He just needs another long bar. Where's that long bar? It's not coming. Wow, Fractal playing so oh. high. Oh, that left side. No. And Fractal knows it's going to be a top out. Well, that's a nice kicker for Fractal there. Oh. Nine sixty one K kicker. But Eric is still perfect. Still flawless. Getting all these back to back maxes on level nineteen. Sharky's still looking for that first max, looking to get something going here. Oh, 
<laughs> Angie it. and Sharky on relatively new games. Actually, everybody pretty much early on, except for Eric. Now past line 100 at 328,000. Bags down another Tetris. On row two, Eric earlier employing methods, playing on higher rows, getting faster drop speeds. Not necessarily faster drop speeds, but pieces hitting the floor sooner. You could actually see the difference back when Eric and Fractal were closer together in their game starts. That it was actually giving him, getting him farther ahead in the number of lines and pieces drop. Oh, okay, okay, okay. See, it shows yeah, so definitely really something cool. to say about aggressive okay, play, okay. even in walls. Okay. okay. To get your yeah. drops yeah, 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 yeah. and your sure, line sure. clears done as soon as possible to get more maxes on the board. And even if something goes wrong, you want to have more time to be able to rectify that situation and get more maxes in time you have. And just again, want to remind everybody that there is the Mancherino available right now for people to help donate to the prizes. We're already at a total right now where we are actually paying out through the top 16, or the top eight, actually the top 16. And if we can get to the goal, you can see on the Mancherino page, if you put exclamation mark Mancherino into the chat, you'll actually see uh, the goals that we have set up. And if we can achieve those goals, then pretty much we can pay $100 out to the almost the entire bracket, the entire top 48. So again, any donation is appreciated, and what a reward for these players, just playing their hearts out, coming all the way out here to Portland, and just putting on such a wonderful show for everybody. Sharky looking really strong here. Gonna have about 500K before transition. And yeah, absolutely, just a quick shout out to, uh, I believe it was Scott who has donated so much to the pool already. Thank you very much. Darky training transition, 524K. Good chance for Max out here. Darky looking to get on the board with the first. Thatch, you've been chasing that fifth max out. And we're still at a position right now where Eric is still with a perfect right now. Has not topped out yet. Having a little bit of an unfortunate board right here. Gonna get that tuck in there, however. However, that Z piece, nowhere really nice to put that. So gonna have to do a little bit of cleanup. Yeah, this pace, there's definitely gonna be some 29 play. Oof. And here we go, finally getting some good pieces in a row. But again, the eyepiece, just a little too early. But he's still going to get the Tetris boom. And Eric, there we go. Beautiful neutral board now. But no eyepiece, there it is, boom. Tetris, and that's not going to be a Tetris. Yeah, he doesn't want to take the triple. But now he's going to need to do some cleaning. Yeah, Eric just really getting droughted there. He finally gets a long bar, and it's going to be about 800,000 points. Yeah, he's definitely going to need a lot of level 29 play here. Because you can see he's at level 28 right now, and he's at 823. So he's going to need a little bit more. Yeah, about six more Tetrises. There's ways to go. Push 20 in line in line. Let's see if he builds up high. OK, he gets a Tetris going into what we used to call kill screen. We are in level 29 play speeds. Yeah, so the question is now, how is he going to approach this? Is he going for Tetris's or is he just going to go for the singles that he needs right now? He has such a lead that I don't think he has to worry about trying to get that many Tetris's, right? I mean, uh, Tetris's, he can probably just go for the singles and clear out this board yeah, little by little. Yeah, you max, because that's what matters the most. Yeah, exactly. And look at this, singles, singles, singles. He's at 933. Beautiful flat burn right there with the eyepiece. And he's actually oh, set himself. Set there like it that. is, boom. Oh, okay, there. that alleviates a lot of pressure right there to get that. And yeah, at this point in time, maybe just go for the singles. Yeah, singling out actually becomes 
more of the strat as you get that much closer. Yeah, that one Tetris made such a big difference. It just shot him right up there. Exactly. And he's only less than 10,000 away. 4,000. To fill it out. There it yes. is! Another max out! Max out number nine. Nine in a row. All on 19 starts. <sighs> so we're looking to see something unprecedented. If Eric ICX can keep up this flawless play through balls, a continuous string of back-to-back <laughs> -back maxes on level 19. Wow! <laughs> and then Fractal getting the max out right there. Eric Heard Fractal. him begging for that eyepiece. Please, please, please. And he finally got it. And so Fractal, Fractal now at eight. eight. Fractal right behind Eric ICX, also with the 19 starts. So strong showing by Fractal here. And again, it's just a, what world are we living in where you have, you know, eight max outs and you're not in the lead of your qualifying <laughs> round. You know, it's kind of odd because our first qualifying round had like Dog and Andy were at the two top play fields too. Yeah. So it's almost like Eric and Fractal are Tetris brothers at this point, pushing each other <laughs> to the limit. And again, is that a know. thing, Tetris Bros? Tetris Bros? Yes, I, I'll say yes. We're Tetris Bros, right? Yeah, we're Tetris Bros. <laughs> All right. There you go. <laughs> James Chen's my Tetris Bro. There we go. Chris Tang is my Tetris Bro. Yeah. Tetris Bros. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. But again, I mean, coming into this event, you know, a lot of people were, oh no, Shark, you're not gonna be able to get that. Eric needs a long bar, gets oh, actually. it. Can Eric survive this and keep the perfect streak alive? No pressure. Oh, I love that. The yeah, way that nice he placed solve. that point down. Yeah, that was Keeping so that nicely clean. done. And there's a flat, flat burn, burn right there. And a mm, little bit of a situation over here. The, Getting back into safety, oh. slowly but surely. Yo. <laughs> Nicely done. Yeah, Eric from Mess to Clean. Uh -oh. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, I think that one's. Oh, no. Okay, oh, so the streak. Oh, the streak is over, the but Eric's still at nine. Yeah, again, but again. What's it up? But again, I mean, uh, nine in a row at 19 start means he is so far ahead of the yeah. curve right now. In terms of, if you could call it, uh, two hour max out pace mm -hmm. because of those 19 starts, still has a chance to tie or surpass Dog and Andy at 13. And now also has a kicker just in case someone can match, say if there are 14 maxes, we still don't know. And it happened, the top out happened relatively early on because so all that speed you gain by starting on 19 might actually be a factor in eliminating that max for that uh, top out completely. Yeah, but unfortunately right now, not necessarily a great slew of pieces here for Eric. And okay. that keep bulleting here, at least oh. from my point of view. Fractal with a tough situation over here. Obviously, Eric in a tough situation as well, but that was at line 19, so, you know, it's all good. But Fractal right now, he's built himself all the way up to level, uh, he's at line 89 already, so doesn't want this game yeah. to go to a waste. So it looks like Dachi is mulling this, maybe for a record, so we'll see what happens with this. Yeah, of course, the uh, rule is here, no mulling oh, anymore in the verses, but from again, since this is uh, for qualifications, you can, if he chooses to use his time up yeah. for this, it's all good. Especially if you have enough axes to definitely get in gold bracket, mm -hmm, then, mm -hmm. you know, you might actually feel better about using that time to practice, be competitive yeah. And, yeah, practice and feel be at the main event and do the best you can because you know in the main event bracket you're going to be 
having to do more than a max out. Yep. So pushing it to level 36 or something is something that players are going to need to be able to do and survive if they want to beat the competition at this point. Yeah, just uh, a little bit unfortunate RNG, but Fractal has been handling it so beautifully. And there we go, that 19-piece drought. Not going to cause him too much consternation here. but has a little bit of a problem here with this LJ Reliance here. But there it is, back-to-back -back L and J is going to be perfect to clean that up. Fractal and Eric both just recently starting a brand new game. So it's going to be a while before they transition or trans double transition. <laughs> So Eric still virtually in the lead because just uh, early, semi early top out. Even having a top out, but still with all those 19 starts, gives Eric a speed advantage. We'll have to see if that actually gets Eric closer to 14, 14 maxes. Again, you can probably hear a little bit in the background. We are here at the Portland Retro Gaming Expo. Once again, home of Classic Tetris World Championships for so many years. Always a pleasure being back here every year. Yeah, it's been too long. I mean, it almost feels like time is moving again. <laughs> okay, now that we're here and we're kind of in the same room that we were in uh, back in 2018. Mm -hmm. Nice tuck right there from Eric and boom, Tetris. Gonna get himself set up. Oh, man, back to back to back squares right there for Eric. Actually, I think it was just two of them, but enough to cause him a little bit of problems. But now the more squares he gets, the better it'll be. Good. Yeah, Fractal actually And again, if we start at level 19, then the transition at 130 lines is to, that's the transition, right? Well, how does that work? Nothing really changes. That's true, that's true. Speed-wise. That's true. But in terms of measuring your score, it's still a good measure of whether or not you're gonna max before you hit 29, et cetera. Right. I know we are so used to calling 19 the transition, but if you start at 19... <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I guess if you uh, count 130 lines and you, you look at the score and you can kind of compare against a little bit higher than 18, then you got more points going in. And it's crazy, too, because that's even one of the things that's, you know, has been talked about potentially for, you know, future rules starting at level 19, forcing everybody to start at level 19. I was almost thinking that you could bring back the rule where uh, players can choose their starting level and it could be mm. 18 or 19. And then depending on, you know, the player knowing their competition, whether or not they think they can handle a 19 start or not, then that could potentially be a strat. And then everybody will have to practice level 19 starts. <laughs> but I'm not sure if that's something people want or not. So I guess Look we'll at this, Fractal. To, something, one of those things that you ask the community about, I guess. Fractal going for the dirty Tetris nice. and he gets it. And it transitions right into the right well Tetris. Perfect. Okay, good, 621 at level 21. That triple high up. Okay, Eric trying to do a little bit of cleaning right there. That eyepiece is going to help tremendously. Look at this. That Oh, and then the O piece. Perfect timing as well. Okay, there was a great sequence of pieces for Eric right there and gets him into a Tetris and a perfectly clean board now. Darky looking really good right now. 98 lines at 472k. 81% Tetris rate. Yeah, one of the Strongest games from Sharky yet. Looking to get that first max. This could be the one. 
Apache just having recently started a brand new game. Just on line 27, line 31 now with a nice 90% Tetris rate early on. See if he can maintain that. Boom, Tetris for Fractal. Fractal with the fist bump. Feeling it here. I love seeing the emotion from the players. Uh oh, a little bit of a, unable to get that piece all the way over to the side fast enough. And so now, can he get that iron piece over there? He got it. Still cleaning. Perfect double nice, burn. Nice there player. you go. Nicely done. Boom, Tetris for Sharky. 572k. Looking Where's for another Tetris line, to see. Please. A 600k transition from Sharky here. There it is, and boom, Tetris for Eric. He's got himself. And boom, Tetris for Sharky. 597k transition. Good position for a max here. We want to see one. Get one on that board. Goes for the triple. Slowly going to set himself back up for to be Tetris ready. There it is. Perfect. Now he just needs that eyepiece. And there it is. Boom, Tetris for Sharky. Fractal about to bang down another max here. Number nine for Fractal. Boom, Tetris for Fractal, just a few line clears away from a max. Sharky with a misplacement, of, with a miss drop over there. Now he's got to do some cleanup. It's another max. Number nine. Getting the board back into a good state here. Ops to burn everything back to the bottom. Oh, that was nice. Okay. Got just the right pieces that he needed. I love that burn right there with the L and the J. Hey, Eric now in, in the three Tetrises of next Ooh. max, which would be number 10. And You're that, in on it with a nice clean board here at oh. level 32. Build the Tetris. Boom, Tetris for Eric. And Thatchy. Thatchy working himself out of a really rough situation. You see that smile on his face because he knows he is in a good spot again. Okay, Eric needing a few more clears. There's a double. Oh, so many line pieces for Fractal. That's a nice, it's a nice thing to have at the start. Eric needing to get something over to the left there. This, he's almost got it. Okay, gets max. a triple. There, there it is. is. Number 10 for Eric. <laughs> Again, 10. 10. So he has put himself up oh, into fourth place officially now. Eric is in fourth place just under Huff and Dog and Pixel Andy. Sharky with the reset after that strong game. Still waiting to get that first one on the board. Actually working on number six. Pretty sure Eric meant to drop that eyepiece one. Call him to the right over there, but he should be fine. Boom. Tetris for Eric. Boom. Another one. Fractal, of course, working on his 10th max out. Yeah, Fractal all is just a little bit behind Eric now. Just uh, like one top out means about half a level behind and you see we're in that situation again eric set himself up into a position where i believe he's probably just going to keep going for the row two tetrises if he can get a long bar that is there it is yep. what a last second adjustment That's oh he's you. going for it again and it pays off boom tetris for eric That's you with the over 600k transition looking really good really strong in this game Wow, Eric with this set. Crazy elevated dirty Tetris. Yeah, he's in a situation right now where he's got to clean this out. Gets the double. There's the single and another single. And he's opened up that well over there. Yep. And he's setting himself up for Three that tre Tetris. There and is. there it is. Boom. And he's going to keep going with it, it looks like. But he's not getting any T's or Z's. Finally gets a couple of Z's back to back. 
And there we go. Set himself up another Tetris. Tuck. Nice. He's got a burn. Yep. Where's that long piece? 19 piece drought. 24 piece drought. What is happening? 30. 30. There it is. Oh. Remember, it was a 35 eyepiece drought that cost Dog his 14th max out yeah. in a row. Oh, we missed that tuck. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that one tuck right there moved it just a little bit too early. So now Fractal is right on the heels of Eric, just uh, still one max Ooh. behind, but... Okay. Chance for a fractal to catch up here. The fractal maxes this out, they'll be tied at 10. Sachi approaching max here. Again, with that great transition score. 25 at 878k. Five Tetrises away. One. Okay. Eric with About a little two bit Tetrises of Tetrises away. Yeah, Eric with a little bit of an awkward setup over there. Clearing that out, but as you mentioned, Thatchy right now, it's the one we're watching here. It's very close yeah, to very trying close. to get that Tetris, but unfortunately, he's gonna have to set up kind of a single. Actually, no, he's got it, it right here. There's, There's one. one, and one more will do it. Right on the cusp here. Is he gonna just go for the the, the, the easy easy mode at this point in time? Well, I, third, I believe the triple so. Could it, I, I don't know how much that would have been worth, but well, okay. He just needs the double. Oh, actually, he needs one more. <laughs> He's doing this the hard There it <laughs> is. The double. Max there you out go. for Thatchy. And that's going to be six. Looks like Thatchy's in Mullen mode. Just going to ride this out. Yep. Going to keep practicing. Another one. Center ball Tetris for Thatchy. Not even on 29 yet. Yep, Thatchy, of course, going to keep playing just to get that practice in here because pretty sure he feels comfortable that he's qualifying at this point and so going to practice yeah, it, this up for... It is interesting that Mullins are completely banned in the actual brackets, but it's okay to do it here. So if you're going to Mullin at all, get it all out here in Qualls. <laughs> But that could be a valid strat because if everybody today, besides Thatchy, is ending their game with the max, then they're actually not getting as much 29 plus right. practice in. So Thatchy might be on to something here. Uh, look at this. Fractal is on the road for an early max out here. That's what he's hoping yeah, to get. Yeah, away. But six. There's one. Yep. 27 right here. A bit here. of a mess to clean up here. Oh, nice solve. <laughs> Just like that, clean again. Tetris ready. Win for that long bar. And of course, this is when the drought shows up because that's how it works. Yeah, you know, could have gone for some doubles and been done with there it. There it is. It. There Boom, it is. Tetris for Fractal. And a max out for yeah, Fractal. Number 10, now tied with Eric. Whew. So that makes five players in the qualifying rounds already with double digit max outs. Dog and Pixel Andy with 13, Huff with 12, and now Eric and Fractal with 10 each. Yep. They're getting crazy. I mean, we told you, yeah, double digit max outs. I remember when it was special just to get more than one. Right. <laughs> We're like, Corian got how many? Three? And this is just like, now it's just like, three might make gold bracket. 
And again, you know, if you haven't seen the CTWC stuff in a while and you're wondering why the max outs rates have gotten so high now, it is because of the advent of the technique of rolling. As you can see, a lot of the players here, they're not tapping the D-pad. What they're actually doing is they're tapping the actual controller itself to create the uh, movement. And so they're rolling their fingers on the back of the controller. And you can see by using four or three fingers, they can control how many times they move it. And it's so much faster oh. than even hyper tapping. That's you with a hang. But early on, that yeah. you didn't lose much time there. Just got the 30 minute warning. So given that you can make seven max out an hour if you play really well, that means you can get three to four in half an hour. Eric can make that 14. Oh yeah. Is it within, and is already on the way to max out number 11. So there you could, go. Look at that, 81 at level 22. Yeah, yeah. Eric is uh, really tearing up now and uh, really is in position to get 14 at this pace. What's the record for earliest max out in a qualifying round? Do we know? Probably not on, on hand that we know exactly. We'd, we'd have to have one of our data experts yeah. like uh, Puppy or Bidwell or something. <laughs> they'd, they'd be able to answer, answer that. Oh, Eric just uh, you Tetris is away, three away. Looking really clean here. Wow, that adjustment. Wow, boom, Tetris for Eric. Just Eric on fire with the precision here, making last moment <laughs> frame perfect adjustments. Yeah, well, making a statement. And there it putting is, the boom. entire field on notice. One Tetris away now from maxing number 11 here. There it is. Oh, at Eric level ICX. 25. At level 25, we got a max out. And again, that is what you call stress-free maxing out right yep. there. Get deal the deal early. No need for 29 play. Just get that max as fast as possible with the 19 start. Like, that game might have to be looked at in terms of duration because that was a level 19 start and really early so mm -hmm. just in terms of being fast that's definitely one for the books to take a look at they're like all right what's a fast max on 19 well eric's number 11 could be a record breaker there we'll have to see that with a big spire just got s bursted at some point see the results of that the block burst as well just that piece set <laughs> oh man one of those things you just look at the board and you're like yeah the game was mocking the player but <laughs> more blocks just stacking Jeez, up there. yeah i mean at this point in time it's just like he's got like a one piece code or something you know one of those tetris effects that's a really good looking uh <laughs> column two tetris dirty there nice from Thatchy, making the best of the situation there. And you know, I, I do this every year for those people who may be tuning in for the first time and you're like, you know what, I when I play Tetris, you know, I can definitely, you know, this is a very different Tetris. NES Tetris is very different than what you're used to in a lot of the modern Tetrises. And one of the beautiful things is that uh, Tetris Effect has actually added a classic mode into the game. So if you want to see, if you want to experience how hard this is, you can do that by going to Tetris Effect, playing the versus mode, set the computer, play against the computer, put him to level one, let the computer die and see how well you can survive on the classic mode to get an idea of just how difficult it is what these players are doing. Yeah, the name of the mode is Classic Score Attack and it replicates the rules that we use here in the CTWC. So you want a taste of that action and maybe even practice for coming Aww. to one of our events. Yeah. Tetris Effect Connected is a great way to do it and you can get it on any platform, Xbox, PlayStation 4, Nintendo Switch, three PC platforms, Microsoft Store, Epic Store, and Steam. So many different ways to play Tetris Effect Connected and now yet more ways to play classic Tetris. 
Yeah, and Eric had a burst of some really, really unfortunate pieces there. Weren't even letting him burn at all. And so had to top out and start a new game over here. Yeah, so right now, Eric and Fractal are neck and neck. Yeah, I think so, yeah. Okay, okay. But with that top out, Fractal up a little bit on getting 11 and tied. Both gunning for 13 or 14 maxes here with less than 30 minutes to go. Yeah, both of them. Oh, nice tuck right there from Eric. Now just waiting for that long bar, but look at this, a 33 piece drought, 37 piece drought. And at least the pieces that he has are good for cleaning. And there was 42 piece drought for Eric right there yeah. that he had to get through. And yeah. again, and again, Modern Tetris is use the seven bag. So you're guaranteed at least an eyepiece every, every 14 pieces, at least. Not the case here. Fractal, of course, still working on his 11th max out here. Beautiful tuck. Sharky still trying to get that elusive first one right now. Looking good on this game, though. 100 lines in, 454K. We're probably going to see 500, 550 at least transition. Yeah, but again, he's Ooh. just not getting the pieces that he needs. Oh, oh. no, that left side. Yeah, Sharky that was partly, just... partly uh, presetting the game to get more attempts and just a really, really bad sequence of pieces right there. Again, even if you don't get the perfect pieces, a lot of times you can get the pieces necessary for easy burns, but sometimes you can't even get the pieces for that. And that was definitely one of those sequences that Sharky got at the end over there. They just stopped giving him the pieces that would work in any capacity. Yeah, keep in mind that Sharky still plays DAS. Which, at this point, if uh, we're worried about tapping, you know, being sort of uh, going extinct, I mean, to play DAS at a high level you know, is absolutely commendable and something that, you know, kind of like seeing, you know, players using what they've got to do the best they can with yeah. it. Obviously, you know, Everybody knows, and we all miss him dearly. Jonas, the greatest Daz player of all time. Setting the example, winning so many of these CTWCs. We can only imagine what he would think of this rolling phenomenon here. Yeah, the point that Jonas was at when he was playing in the last tournament. There was no rolling yet. <laughs> yeah, rolling hadn't been around, but you know, he had been uh, thinking about a new technique. Right, there was the documentary where he was uh, uh, talking with the drummer, I believe it was, and they were talking about techniques, and they were talking about the track and field techniques. Yeah, and doing something with that, and it was basically rolling without actually putting the last few pieces of it together, which were flipping the controller over and drumming right. on and that the backside. Of, and that, of course, came from Cheese. Cheese really said, I mean, honestly, making his mark on Tetris, on NES Tetris. Yeah, revolutionizing what's possible and making post-29 play possible. No longer a kill screen. Now it's a skill screen. It's the thrill screen. Fractal right now, level 24. He's on pace to get almost a similarly fast max out, potentially at level 25 like we saw Eric do yeah. earlier. Look at that, 94. Yeah, good setup too. Clean board for Fractal. <sighs> and Eric is getting that drought again. He's not getting the line pieces. Okay. Having to take 
the burns. Where's the long bar? Oh, man. Okay. It gets the right Perfect. pieces to burn. Nice solve there to keep it safe and keep that ability open. He droughted. Oh, this drought is... There, there it is. Boom. Oh, yeah. That's just refractal. You can see the look the on his face. Singles. Like, really? There it is. Oh, <laughs> just refractal. With Level the 11 26. max. Yeah. Now tied with Eric at 11 maxes. Man, he almost got droughted into another kicker. And he already has like a 960-something kicker. So, right. the, the, like, any kicker that he there. gets at this point is almost useless to him. Right, so currently, if this were to end right now, Fractal would actually win because of the higher kicker. So they're really neck and neck in kind of like different ways. <laughs> so Fractal and Eric with 11 max outs here. Oh, last second adjustment right there from Eric. Gonna work out beautifully. Boom, Tetris for Eric. Working on his 12th. Where is that S piece there? Finally, no T's either. There it is. Okay. Gotta have to start doing some cleaning now. There we go. Boom. Boom. Tetris for Sharky. Sharky, 515K at 105 lines. This is probably one of the strongest starts of Sharky. Showing the power of Das. Let's go. Another Tetris for Sharky. 561 at 113 lines. This is Sharky's best chance at a max. And Eric with some beautiful survival play just now. Eric, that just change away. Okay, gets it. At 226 lines, level 28, that'll be number 12. Uh, and so now Eric in the lead. And speaking of cheese, by the way, cheese, Thatchy, Dylan, and Laser all tied with six max outs right now. So Thatchy trying to get there, but of course Thatchy has the uh, lower kicker uh, than most of them there. So he's yeah, third so amongst even the with six. six max outs. That's still 13th place. What is up with that? <laughs> Okay, Sharky transitioning. High score, 688K at level 20. Another Tetris. Sharky looking really good, really strong here. Looking to get that first max on the board. At level 20, but he's getting a drought right now, so that's why he's doing all this cleaning. So it's nicely done so far. There it is, finally, the high piece. And yeah, you see the lean back right there, like, thank you. Yeah, and with good runway here, Dude. make that max. 79% is fantastic yeah. right now. This a monster dash score here. Look at that, all nine. Boom, Tetris for Sharky. All right, now he needs to figure out how to fill out column number nine over there. That should do it. Now he's Tetris ready once again. We're looking really good. Opposite to take the vertical J there. Okay, gonna have to get in column one and two. There we go. And now needs to clean out. Oh, he changed his mind at the last second. He was gonna Fix do something with else. the tuck. Oh. Okay, nice flat. Nice flat yes. burn. Yep. Roll Beautiful. back down. What you yep. need to do. As player, you cannot mess around at this height at all. Yeah, yeah. Shark, you're really getting back into safety. Nice. And this needs... There it is. Okay, gets it. Okay, back to safety. Not Tetris already yet, but almost. <gasps> oh, no. Okay. okay. Gets another long bar. Takes a triple. triple. Good, good for score. Okay. And it's Tetris ready. Where's that long bar? Where's that long bar? Nice burn. Okay. Beautiful burn. the stack. 19, there and it is. Boom, uh. Tetris for Sharky. Four Tetris is away. There's one. Come on. Three more will do it. Level 26, so there's a bit of a runway. Almost Tetris ready. Oh, just shy. Just shy. Yeah, he's playing a little bit riskier here because he wants that. So close, we're getting there. All right, nice. Oh, there Opens it, is, it up. There it is. Boom, Tetris for Sharky, 954. 
Two will do it. Level 27. Still a little bit of runway before 29. There's one. Ooh. Boom. Tetris for Sharky. 989, uh -oh. 639. A little bit of a misdrop. A little bit of a misdrop, but he should be yes, able to. Yes, he needs one more Tetris. Or at 991. Oh, he could just clean it out with some singles Maybe at this point. Maybe at 28. You want a guarantee. Oh, that's right. Of some kind. You can't. At so least a triple. Okay. Four oh. nine 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 four nine nine. That should do it. Let's yes. go. Oh, Let's Tetris go. For, <laughs> boom! Double for Sharky. Not a Tetris, but getting that max out. First one on the board. Let's you can go. Just see the ex exclamation from Sharky and the relief. Getting that first max on the board. And doing it for the Daz players out there. Yeah. Representing Daz. Daz is not dead. <laughs> Although I could look at the board right now and see where the one max gets you. The ranking. And prior to whatever update is coming next. Dollar with one max and a 980 kicker is in 31st place. Oof. Thatchy right there with a little but bit I of think, a... I uh, think Sharky has a really good kicker, so one one max and a good oh. kicker should still be in top 30. All right, we've got a 15-minute call right over there, and Thatchy is in a very precarious situation right now. Can he dig his way out of this? He wants that long bar, but it is not coming, so he's gonna have to dig through here. Where's that the eyepiece? The L. Oh, nice. Okay, opens a well. Just there it is. All of our over. It's just a triple, but still, at Tetris least it's ready. survivable. Row four. Dirty Ooh. Tetris for Thatchy. Boom, Tetris for Thatchy, and now time for some cleanup here. Yeah, looking good already, though. Now, is he going to just stick with it over there? Yes, he is, and boom, Tetris, and he's going to be able to make the transition back over to the left side. There it is. Well, you can see both Fractal and Eric. Eric with 12 max outs now. See Eric right now with that three column deep hole over there, had to fill up with the long piece. Now waiting for another eye piece. There it is, boom. Tetris for Eric. And another one. So look, Eric looking really strong right now. Yeah. He's got that 61% Tetris rate here at level 23. Has a little bit of a misdrop drop over there on the left side. Gonna have to clean that up a little bit. Okay, he looks good. Looks fine here. No problem. Well, except for that uh, S burst right there. But he's right up. 22-piece drought. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, and then gets that tuck in there. Wow. Whoa, that left side. Ooh. Gets it over. Wow. Nice. That speed. And, and then there we go, the Tetris. Oh, Tetris wow. Now that's going to be a single over there. <laughs> but he, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. A little bit of a misdrop, but again, he yeah, should be fine. one mess to another, and uh, back in the dig. But again, we've already seen how many of these that Eric has been able to get himself out of, so... Yeah. No worries here just yet. Ooh. Yeah, he needs to get to that and column the, the priority nine. is to actually get the board clean for 29 hits which is going to happen real soon. Because that is dangerously high. Come on. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh. The pieces are just not cooperating. And they're three lines away from 29. Oh. Oh. And that is oh. not going to be survivable. That's uh, a kicker. 883. I think that might be... That might be the kicker for Eric. Yeah. It's still not as high as Fractal's, so... Fractal could take, if Fractal maxes this, they'll be tied again at 12. 
In fact, it will be in the lead. Yeah, and remember, Huff also has 12, but Huff's kicker was only 6,000 points away from a max out. <laughs> so uh, Might as well be 13, yeah. Yeah, so Huff basically probably has the best kicker at this point. But yeah, Eric definitely got hit with a very bad sequence of pieces right at the end over there. Yeah, in that case, yeah, even just burning down, you really need to, even if you're rolling, and even if you can play 29, being like four fifths up on the screen isn't gonna be survivable. <laughs> Ooh, speaking of not great pieces right now, Eric is not getting any S's or T's at all. So if that he maxed again and it's mulling, which we will see in the brackets, if that's a really good strat just for getting in the experience in the competitive environment to play post-29. Yeah. Again, all of the roll, like you were saying, like all of the rolling, any technique that you use, Man, sometimes if those pieces just are not cooperating. <laughs> yeah, you have this margin of build that happens. Then. But look at that from Eric. Nicely done. Dug out of there. Gets the triple. And with that O piece over there on the left, he's opened up his field. And now time for some uh, regular play here again. So Sharky looking to have really strong back-to-back -back games. 571k at 125 lines. It's gonna be close to 600k transition. And another max for Fractal right there, and that yep. will put Fractal at 12. So and both Eric and Fractal at 12, but Fractal with the higher kicker. So now Fractal is officially in fourth place right now. If he can get another max out, he'll tie a uh, Andy and Dog at 13. We are 13. getting close. Right, we got the 15 minute warning. That was a few minutes ago. So we're gunning for, they're gunning for 14. The next max will be 13. How much is the time? I believe we're about eight minutes away. It is 4.37 p.m. and time okay. yes. is- Eight minutes, yeah. eight minutes. And again, Thatchy, mulling right now, just playing it out, trying to get that practice in for tomorrow. And for those new to the scene, bowling is when you've already won or when you've already reached your goal, continuing to play, even when you don't have to. And Thatchy just showing a clinic of how to play post-29. I remember one of the reasons why, you know, these players are, I mean, if you're at, you know, 10 max outs like Fractal and Eric were, you know, you've qualified. But yeah. remember, you're seated based on your qualification. Yeah, so the but higher you're in the middle, it doesn't change too much. So I feel like if you're maybe at the very, very top or the very, very bottom, you actually do want to not waste any time. But if you're in the middle, you're only going to be like trading with the same person right. anyway. But I mean, for the people who are at the yeah. top, they definitely want to keep trying to get as many max outs as possible because that means you will be playing players who are lower seated at yep. that point. So you want to get yourself the best seed position yep. possible. And, and so that's what Fractal, Eric, uh, Fractal and Eric are going for right now. Yeah, that Sharky wanting to get that second max, having a really strong game here. 68% tetris rate, 821 at level 24. So max definitely in range here. And also wanting to seal the deal on this max to maybe even get another game in before time runs out. You can see right now a little bit of pressure I know on these players right now because they know the time is running out. So you see right now Tetris rate 31%, 46% on Fractal and on Eric's side. Oh, nice. I'm actually really impressed how Perfect. many maxes that Thatchy has gotten with the Molens in there. That is crazy. That's, you know, that could be another strat. It's just like making all those maxes yet having time to Molen. It's a big flex. At least I think so. <laughs> and boom, Tetris for Sharky, 962. Second max for Sharky in the range. Oh yeah, and at level 27. Yeah, looking good. Got good space over here. He just needs that long bar. Uh, there one. it is. Oh! Another max for Sharky, number two, two. on the board. 
two maxes for Sharky. Back to back, Sharky showing that Das is not dead and will probably make gold bracket at this rate. Again, depending on how the future rounds proceed. Definitely feeling it right now. And you know what? Probably wants to go for the back-to-back-to-back, uh, to back to back, right? Yeah. Go for the Chicago Bulls game. right now. Let's do it. I'm running out. There's another game left to play with two back-to-back -back maxes. The third could, could happen. Five-minute warning. Five-minute warning. Five minutes left. There's a five-minute warning. Let's go. Yep. You can see right now, Eric has upped his percentage up to 40%. And that's finally given up the, the mullen there level. <laughs> uh, 54 is probably not really 54. I don't know what the hex on that is, but... It is probably his 54. 481 lines. Crazy. Yeah, Fractal and Eric just really neck and neck right now in terms of games and kickers. They both tied at 12. If they both max this, they'll both hit 13. But with Fractal's higher kicker, Fractal will be in the lead. As you can and see, remember, right? if we run out of time, they get to play out their game. Yep, and so they know that at this point. However, Eric, in an interesting situation right now, he's at level 26, and he's at just at 797,000 points right now. So actually, no, look at this. See, this, this last few lines that he's been playing here, getting a lot of Tetris, is a very clean board right now. This is actually playing out really well for Eric. And another Tetris. That's like six back-to-back -back Tetrises here at level 26, 27, and 28. Yep. Get to take care of this. Axe in the next three Tetrises. Oh, just goes for the triple. Just opts for the triple. Level 29 play. Here we go. And yeah, again. what's the strat here with five minutes left? Do you try to get the max faster so you get that last game in? Or do you play safely to just guarantee that you get the next one? I think you play safely. I think you play safely. The amount of time you've put into this game, I feel like is more important than starting a new game and trying to go for one more max. Yeah. You're already here, so go yeah, for it. Five minutes. Well, we're about at see, three now, so definitely we'll know whether it's gonna be a max faster than that. Uh, Fractal is probably the one that's more on the edge of whether or not this will be leading to another game. Yeah, and of course, Eric also knows that he is obviously one of the best at playing at level 29 speed. So I feel like the confidence in that factor right now is going to come to play here. Okay, Fractal, 759. Got a little bit more than two minutes left. 700, 900, early top out. 977. Sharky also starting a new game. 982. Just continuing with this play. Like I said, yeah. nothing crazy. It looks 990680. And with enough time to start a new game. Oh, he's... I there it is. it is. All right. Number 13 for Eric's ICX. And he has enough time to start one more game. He yeah. wants that number one seed. Eric could, I believe Eric is number one seed right now because the kicker's higher than dogs. And actually, Fractal. Wait, shit, how much time is left? Am I, am I gonna get this? Less than two minutes. Less than two minutes. So Fractal Fractals. in range can do it. Yeah. He just needs that long bar. There it is. One. Boom. One more Tetris. One minute left. One minute left. How's Fractal going to play this out? Fractal needs some clears now oh. to get that judging on the screen. Oh. Fractal needs material on the board. Oh. There it is. Again. Max Fractal. out for Fractal. Go, 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 Fractal. Take the picture. Is he going to start He's another game? Take the picture and the start. It's 13 each. 13 each for Eric and Fractal now. With Fractal with the higher kicker. So Fractal technically 
in first place. In first place. So it will all come down to what well, no, happens here. Actually, because Pixel Andy has no kicker, so technically... Oh, gosh, they, they how does both that work? Yeah, have no, you're, yeah, you're right. Andy's in fourth right now, and Dog is in third, because both Fractal and Eric have higher kickers <laughs> at 13, 13 maxes apiece. Oh. So here we go. Both but, players going for their 14th max out. And, you know, they topped out a couple of times. But as you mentioned, the start at level 19 is what gives them that time. So we are at time now. Yep. So this is it right here. It's 14 max outs or nothing. <laughs> right. Unless the kicker, the only thing that can change is the kicker. If uh, Eric gets a higher kicker than Fractal, the position can change. But if they both max out and keep the same kicker, then Fractal will, will be mm -hmm. in number one. Yeah, currently, as it stands right now, Fractal is in first place over everyone right now with the highest kicker. But talk about a clutch start. Fractal getting that game and that judgment, the judging of the, the max out in with literal seconds <laughs> to go to start the next game and gets it in. Well, yeah, this is his last game. Okay. Eric is just looking for that long bar. There it is, finally. Now he's not going to be able to get a, a, a Tetris if he gets another long bar right so, here. Here's something but, interesting. Fractal did an 18 start because it doesn't matter anymore. Oh, you're right. So that's Fractal's first 18 start. Eric continuing with 19. Let's see if that changes anything. But definitely seeing that level 19 starts give you more time, gives you some room to make mistakes because your know, dog was just going continuously, got to 13 with a decent kicker, and the kicker only came on the last game. But Eric had a couple of top outs. I think it was okay. either two, maybe three, right now, then, but because of the level 19 starts, was able to make up that time and get more games in. Still got 13 max outs and possibly time for the 14th here. And you can see the separation and score here. This Eric a lot further along, although Eric did beat start quite a bit more at Fractal. We'll have the results of Eric's game quite a bit sooner. Nice, nice burns right there from Eric, and he is going along with that row two Tetris. Gonna do a little bit of cleaning up here, though. Yep, try to get back into that column one Tetris. Actually, oh, mm, what's his plan right now? Go up Tetris or Sharky. Sharky having a very good Third, possible third max attempt here at 510 points, line 122. So Sharky just having three really good games back to back. That's what you want to see. Getting that first max on the board in the qualifier situation is so important. Gives you momentum as a player. Yeah. And yeah. boom, Tetris for Sharky, transitioning, 539K. Yeah, looking really strong with that 66%. Another boom, Tetris for Sharky. He's Tetris ready once again. Yeah, Nine. sometimes you just need to get into the groove, get your momentum. Oh, it's Four a tough situation tough. right now. No, he needs that long bar, but he's got the 14-piece drought right now. There it, there is. it is. Boom. Taking the safety triple there. Wise decision, keeps the board clean. Meanwhile, we got droughts on both sides for Eric and for uh, Fractal, but look at Fractal. He is at an 84% Tetris wow. rate right now at 103 lines. But of course, remember, this was starting at level 18. 18. You gotta wonder whether or not that changes. Maybe Fractal could play much more aggressively on 18, and having yeah. played 19, this could be going in slow motion. Exactly. It probably feels so relaxed right now Two for him. hours worth of playing on 19 going to 18, <laughs> right? 
You feel like Neo from the Matrix is like more time. <laughs> it's Tetris time, not the player, but just everything in slow motion. She can see back it. to a clean board. Eric is at 47% at level 24, so potentially is going to need some level 9 play. Now he needs something in there to clear out that column. He, okay, there we go. Perfect. And there it is. Tetris for Eric. And the thing is, with, it, with time not being a factor, Eric can just play post-29 for a very long period and not worry about, <laughs> you know, this is going to be like the last That's game. That's true. That's yeah. true. He's not eating into his own time anymore, so he can play until level 141 if he really yep. wanted to. Let's get the glitch colors. <laughs> Sharky getting closer. Level 25, 760K. Yeah, getting three max outs with a Daz player. Yeah, I mean, what an incredible... An incredible way to get the three max outs would be all three back-to-back -back on the three last games. Oh, that eyepiece came one just a little too early. But there it is, boom. boom. Tetris for Sharky. Okay, he's Tetris ready again. Gonna need to economize here. Okay, it looks like Thashi is gonna exit with that max. Yep, one final max out for Thatchy. So puts himself uh, even higher onto the leaderboard. I think that's nine for Thatchy. <laughs> oh, oh it's okay. Sharky with a dangerous situation. Okay, Sharky. Oh, Not that's really gonna, fixable. That's Strong gonna be the game end Sharky, for... but that's gonna get. Sharky, two max. But Good again, kicker. amazing play by Sharky. Great job right over there. So Eric continuing yeah. on level 31 now. Can line out, do it however he wants. Get that last max. You yeah, have an Eric playing at that level 29 speed. You can see he's at level 32 right now. 964. Can he get number 14 on the board, breaking the records again? Yeah, we are in record contention here. And it's I, funny because... I love hearing close. the energy from Eric. I'm yeah. sitting right next to him and I can hear him. You know, Eric and Fractal are like neck and neck right now. But world records are actually broken and being broken at this moment. And nine, nine, seven, seven. Oh, and there it is. It is. Max 14, 14, 14, 14 max outs. 14 max outs. For Eric. 14 I max outs. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and 14 for 14 Fractal. For Fractal. World records shattered. <laughs> This is absolutely insane. 14 max outs. When we saw 13 each from Pixel and from Dog, we thought maybe that would be the highest, you know, total in a qualifying round. But 14 here yeah, for Fractal this. and Eric ICX don't even need the kickers to get themselves into first and second place here, qualifying yeah, into the, the gold bracket. To determine between them which one is in first and second. <laughs> But yeah, and again, what an exclamation point, and what a case, starting on 19 yeah, for and all how, your ball dude, How about this level of play that we are having here at Classic Tetris World Championships? Thank you, everybody in the crowd, for being here yeah. and watching the best Tetris action you can ever find in the world. Just getting better and better with every year, just the players pushing themselves <laughs> to the limits. You love to see it. Round one, we had Dog versus Andy getting the 13. This time we had Eric and Fractal getting the 14. What will we see next? <laughs> Let's go. And again, just as a reminder, I mean, keep in mind too that Andy didn't top out at all. He had 13 in a row. Yeah. So he's flawless at 13. But again, look, obviously, shout out to everybody who's here in the audience. But if you guys are at home and you are watching this amazing action, that Macherino is still there for you guys. That's right. Exclamation. our players. We're get our prize. Cool. Okay. Hey guys, turn this way. These players. Okay. For <laughs> we got a reward. Players for their awesome gonna... performances, like we saw here, here from Fractal and Eric. This chair. Get oh, you got it. So here we go. Number one <laughs> and two seeds.
Level 19 starts all the way except for the last one. It's actually, <laughs> I thought, a pretty smart strat. What's on your mind? And, uh... I mean, look, the, the question that I have here is, was it a goal to try to get 14 to get above where Andy and Dog were? Yeah. I, I think I just, this the entire time, I just saw that, like, Eric was, like, consistently 400k ahead of me <laughs> in the next game. And I was, like, just zeroed in on just, like, catching, <laughs> catching him. I think it might have actually made me perform better. I've done a bunch of practices and none of them were this good before. Honestly, I can say the same thing about Fractal. Yay. <laughs> in, the, in the end, he kind of was like a bit ahead of me. And yeah. like, I went into this like without any goals. So I haven't, I haven't like practiced at all. I haven't played the game in a week, you know? <laughs> that's actually true, by the way. So that's why I was mentioning this with, uh, with James and the Tetris Bros thing. Maybe the strat is to be up here next to someone that's really evenly matched with you, and then you get a dog and Andy, and then you get a fractal and Eric situation, <laughs> and you're just pushing each other right live. Is that what you guys were feeling? Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> I think if you think this is insane, you got to wait till the finals. Oh, oh yeah, I don't think true. any of us are ready this for is that. Just, this is just the beginning. I agree. I mean, obviously 14 uh, max outs in the qualifying round is a record now, right? So, I mean, how does it feel now being the two players that are the only players to hold that record at this point? That's awesome. Not gonna, that's not going to last forever, but for now. <laughs> it won't, okay, it won't it last forever, good. but you got to realize it. It will last for at least a year, right? It will last for at least an hour. <laughs> <laughs> at least two hours, actually. At least a few hours. Yeah. We'll see. We don't know what's going to happen later. All right, well, okay, looks guys. like we got to get our next play a set of players All in right. there. All right, congratulations, you guys. guys.